Hey, how's it going? It's Uncle Josh. We're back on Uncle Josh Gaming. We're gonna finally revisit and play some more Shakedown Hawaii. So this is gonna be part 9 of the Let's Play. So we're gonna get right back into it. how to play this now. Oh. You. Protection money. Now. You don't know who owns this place, do you? Hey! Oh! I got the subscription. So, plus one, so I'm up to 43 of 83 secured shops. I'm at $15,585, and that went up by 600. Yeah, we got a mission complete. So, there's a few other places to kind of get a hold of, so. Add fuel surcharge. We'll buy all the multipliers. Nah, gift card it. Oh, let's see. Oh, can't do anything. I'm here to check your computer's configuration. The boss never mentioned anything about. I'll just check your DIP switches. On my way. Alright. So let's flip the switch. Let's try it now. The computer is broken. Well, you're lucky I'm here then. I can sign you up for our perpetual extended warranty plan immediately. Yeah. So we've got 44 of 83 sh secured shops. Daily income is now $16,023. That went up by 438. So we got another spot here. Doesn't look too safe around these parts. If I were you, I'd subscribe to some sort of protection plan. This is a shakedown? Get out. Those customers, your regulars? Alright. Oh, I failed it. I forgot. I gotta get in their face. Doesn't look too safe around these parts. Okay, so we've read that. Stop, I'll pay. So there we've got 45 of 83. And our daily income is now $16,431. So we're doing pretty good. What's this one? Oh, it's a mini retail. Retail space. 
I'll buy this. So we'll add clickbait. Store credit card. Sponsored content. Add independent studies. Sounds like a good investment to me. Sold by the small produce market. There. We pretty much own this block almost. Ooh, small produce market. I'll buy that. Economy office building, I'll buy that too. And then we got a mission over here too, so we'll try this. Let's initiate the shakedown. Looks like you need some protection around here. Protection money, my boss would kill me. Your legs are shaking. Perhaps you need to sit down. Oh, he got me. Okay, okay, stop. I'll fork it over. There, now we got 46 of 83. Our daily income is now $16,791. Casual dining. Alright, let's buy it. Went all that effort, so we may as well. Ah, beauty shop. Let's initiate a shakedown here. This island's built on the backs of small business such as yours. You should think about investing in its future to keep it that way. You picked the wrong store, buddy. Daily income is now seventeen thousand thirty-four dollars. That went up by two hundred and forty-three dollars. Ooh, a beauty shop. Let's get it. Get gift cards on there and uh, a store credit card. Click bait. Add convenience fees. There we go. Okay, so we've got shakedowns here that we can do, so let's do it. Small businesses such as yours are the lifeblood of the island. It would be wise to ensure they stay that way with some insurance. Is this a shakedown? Get out. You'd fit more patrons in here if you if it were standing room only, don't you think? 
17,490. Alright. Let's check the map. The mini retail space. Let's buy it. There we go. Haircuts. Let's get a haircut. $76 for daily income. Let's buy the hair salon. Then we're gonna add some modifiers onto it. Store credit. Click bait. Marketing spin. We'll add a convenience fee, why not? The virtual firing range? So that's where I left my charging cable. I've got 6 of 30 for that. Let's uh, buy a vending machine. Okay. guy getting squashed. I'm generously at your service to provide you with the protection you truly need. We don't take kindly to threats around here. Uh oh! $1,276 for daily income. 
we're gonna buy this. substantial surge in hit and run some destroying deaths left lately. And then, like, we had this young guy with no pre-existing conditions. He was forking out for the five-star platinum life insurance policy. We can't actually afford to pay out that policy. Damn it. Well, no body, no death certificate, no dice. Or, at the very least, we'll stall it until the next quarter. I need another trace. Right. Yep. Perfect, thanks kid. Line of ours is being delivered to the wrong location. Track their vehicle down and offer a chauffeur the night off so you can reroute the delivery. Steal the hearse carrying the body before it reaches the funeral home. was just a drop in the bucket. Haven't you seen the news? Hit and runs and carjackings have skyrocketed. Our insurance division will never see a profit with this volume of claims. We better get off getting into the casket business. The casket business, you say? That gives me an idea. Talk later. Oh, for crying out loud. Earn revenue from those who pass on by purchasing a funeral home. Alright. Meanwhile... Fell. 
so we'll head back. Printing money, offline reading. Did you see the front page of the paper today? Yeah, that's old news. It was trending last week. Hmm. By the way, I need you to pick up a computer printer. I'm having trouble getting through these reports. Staring at that screen's too hard on my eyes. Yeah, okay. Ooh, what's that? Store vehicles and garages to save them for later. Okay. So we're gonna park and save. We're gonna head to the blue screen emporium. Oh, I went through. Separately. Separately? Doesn't work without one? Well, my shift at subprime starts at 15. You'll need to go pick one up yourself. Cable sold separately. What a business model. I better get in on this. Alright, let's buy the blue screen emporium. Division meeting starting soon. Alright, so we gotta go to the food and beverage division. Coming up, Dr. Quack's Top 5 Hollywood Detox Cleanses, verified by Life Coaches. How did a veterinarian become the go-to expert for medical advice anyway? I don't know, but it's the highest rated show on TV right now. Those detox kits will be completely sold out before the episode ends. We've got detox kits too. Alright, farm to wall, legitimate personality. Kim, can you get us a spot on Dr. Quack? One sec. The show's booked up, but we're at the front of the line on the cancellation list. Alright, that'll do. Send me info on who's booked for today's ta uh, taping. I'll see if they're willing to swap slots. And before you ask, no, I haven't heard back from the Death Cam producers yet. Hmm. Ah, 
Al, you near the taxi company? Why, yes I am. Great, grab one of the cars. We've got a special guest to pick up. So, we're headed to the TV studio this morning. Not a problem? Alright, let's go. Oh, I blew my cover. So we're headed to the, the TV studio this morning? Not a problem. Alright, let's go. Okay, so this isn't gonna work. I gotta be very, very careful. Got a call from uh, your agent. They said a hot mm, photo shoot just came up. They want me to drive you there first. your belongings. Your water chariot awaits. Alright, let's drive the photo shoot. Looking, uh, gorgeous, uh, darling. Oh look, you'll get a better shot down there. Let me turn on the wind machine for ya. <laughs> the guest slot just opened up. Get the detox of Bro Cleanse Kit for just $49.95. Ooh, and wait, that's not all. Looks like a great product. We're producing a full product line of detox cleanses, protein supplements, and energy drinks. That's great! I'm somewhat of a cleanser myself. I usually do one every couple months. How long is the detox of bro cleanse? Good question, actually. How many days can someone live on just water? Wait, what? Huh? All right, asset value went up by a thousand dollars. Daily revenue went up by a thousand. We have a new revenue stream. Detox of bro. Have a look on the map. See where. Oh, what do we have here? Blue, the blue screen emporium shakedowns available. So. We'll do it as scooter, I guess. Oh no.
we have here? Let's start the challenge. Product replacement plan. Where are all the customers? Everyone shops online. The only one, or er, they only come here to manhandle our display units. Any actual customers we have left, well, they won't even buy replacement plans anymore. Those were a cash cow. Oh. Customers just need to experience the value of warranties. Follow me. If a customer were to, say, trip and break their new tablet, they'd think twice about turning down a warranty next time. Let me show you how it's done. Got banana peels. Throw them at the customers. Alright, let's throw another banana peel. Think you can handle that? I'll take that as a yes. Ooh, daily revenue increased by a thousand dollars. So let's shake this down. This island's built on the backs of small businesses such as yours. You should think about investing in its future to keep it that way. You picked the wrong store, buddy. Oh! Oh, I failed it. Come on. Okay, let's try it again. Hold it. Okay, okay. Alright, so now we've got 51 of 83 secured shops. Daily re income is $18,876. Do. 
you protection money now. You don't know who owns this place, do you? Buy a soda. Self kit. That sounds like a good idea. I missed. There we go. 
I missed 14%, I got 85%. Perfect. Alright, so now I can go home.
made it home. What now, son? These guys! They're still trying to kill me! Hmm. Why isn't this printing? Subscribe for ink. Huh? What the hell is this? Do I want to subscribe for ink? No, I want this printer to print. Alright. Everyone else puts up with this? Well, yes. We don't have much of a choice, sir. Well, then maybe I should turn my pain into profit and get a piece of this pie, too. Alright, so let's burn Pakalaki Print Co. Just like that. Are you far away? Featherbottom just stormed in. He's going through all our files. Frigging Featherbottom. I'm on my way over. Alright, let's head there. Feather bottom. <laughs> this new diligence report's not a good look. Your leaky condos alone would have done feeble in if it weren't already circling the drain. Psh, you won't find any such evidence. Ha, really? Did you burn your little paper trail? The evidence is in the walls, the pipes, the ceiling. Oh, the corners your crew must have cut. Now you're on the hook for rain screening. <laughs> you're wasting your time here. Feeble's never going to be yours. Friggin' feather bottom. His buildings aren't so pristine. I'll make sure of that. Oh, I hit a car. Dryer's gone. 
Hey, that's my hair dryer. All units, we've got a trespassing thief. on Featherbottom's poorly constructed resort. Featherbottom's reputation and future as a developer are in great jeopardy. Oh, and it gets even better. Featherbottom's so embarrassed by the leaky windows. He's dumping the entire property to shed the brand damage. And I do mean dumping. One dollar and the hotel is ours. Let's get it. You know, Featherbottom owns every beachfront hotel down there, right? And if he'll drop them that easily, how many more could we nab with a little elbow grease? Let's turn Featherbottom's assets into liabilities. Leave him begging someone to take them all off his hands. If that's our long-term strategy, we better... We best acquire our own restoration company. That way we can repair the liabilities afterwards, at cost. Alright, let's buy it. He might raise suspicion if we continue purchasing all his recent liabilities. You've got a point. We should start using a shell corporation. Let's buy a shell corporation. Good, good. I'll call you after I've evaluated his other hotels. Feeble's about to be back on top. I can feel it. What about Featherbottom's takeover, sir? The only takeover will be ours. His hotels are all about to be under new management soon. Round up those reports. Let's get those remaining subsidiaries out of the way. Alright. So I think we're going to end things here for today. We made some uh, pretty good progress. It's been quite a while since we played this game, I know. So... I'd like to thank everybody for joining me for uh, Let's Play Shakedown Hawaii with Uncle Josh. This is uh, part 9 of the Let's Play. We'll uh, revisit this again soon. Thanks for joining me. Until next time.